Okay, hello friends. It's been a while, really. 15 months and a few days since the last video I did. So it's time to tell you about some news in my life and some ideas I have for the future of this uh, YouTube channel regarding the org mode uh, part. So let's come to the news. This is, um, I don't know how to tell it. It's, it's, some people would consider it bad news. I just consider it as an opportunity. The news in this is my job that I've been doing now for a lot of years. Uh, this job will be finished within the next 18 months because my company decided that they want to shut down the uh, Augsburg site where we are located. So this means 1800 people will be laid off and they have to look for new jobs. So this is something a lot of, of my colleagues are a bit, um, how to say, freaked out and, and very nervous about this. But I mean, I'm old and I know my value and I'm, I'm not afraid at all because I'm, I, when the, the news came out that the company is closing, um, I got so many mails from uh, headhunters and from other firms that said, okay, we would like you to, to be in our team. So uh, whenever I will lose my job, this is just uh, the, the usual thing that you can say everything in life has an expiration date, but it's not a tragedy. It's just one door closes and I guess 10 doors open. So I have to select the uh, door I want to enter. I'm also, this is now we, we come a bit to the org mode part of uh, life. At the moment, I'm also considering that I, how to say, uh, might start uh, my own business as a entrepreneur, solopreneur, or whatever you call it. I mean, I have uh, a long experience in uh, personal productivity. And so the last uh, few weeks I was thinking, can I uh, make a, a job out of this that, that pays me my bills? Because that's, that's the real uh, thing we are all struggling for, is that we need some money to pay our bills. Otherwise, uh, well, life would be much easier, but nevertheless, I, I was thinking and I, I have some ideas and uh, I want to show them to you and, and yeah, you can decide if they are reasonable or, or if they are completely crazy or whatever. So let me just switch to the presentation mode. I'm now small, I hope. and. My idea is I, I will uh, have a principle in my life that, that I call LÖPA. LÖPA is just an acronym for, you see it, uh, life improvement by a reasonable productivity attitude. The, the, the main goal is life improvement. We want to make our lives better. I don't want to have a job where I'm struggling and, and um, I'm losing my health. I want an improvement. And the other part is reasonable productivity attitude. So let's see what, what is reasonable productivity attitude. I, I can quote David Allen on that. You see, David Allen uh, once said, you can do anything, but not everything. And he's totally right with that. Okay, we have org mode. We have a very uh, strong system that helps us to manage our lives. But... Uh, even with this secret weapon that we have. Uh, the idea some people have, oh, now I have a tool, I can do everything. But that, that's not true. You have to really decide what do I put on my plate. Is it uh, all really jobs that I have to do that are urgent, that are necessary? Or is there, is there anything that you say, okay, uh, I don't give a fuck for that. I, I just don't want to do this. So. I mean, uh, really, don't try to do everything. Don't try this at home. I mean, I, I know I'm, I was fa falling for this trap as well. And uh, I had to learn uh, the hard way that you just have to, to learn to say no. Even if you have a, a, a secret weapon, uh, uh, really like a lightsaber of the Jedi's, uh, it doesn't help you. Your day also has only 24 hours. It means 80... 6,400 seconds, uh, there is no more time. And so be really reasonable 
with the things that you put on your list. There is no duty for you that you have to do everything. You don't have to save the world. You can contribute to saving the world, but it's not your job, okay? So this this is my, my motto. My, if I'm going to be a, a company entrepreneur, I say, okay, life improvement by reasonable productivity attitude. So really think before you say, yes, I can do that. No, you don't. Uh, you, you just should think. Okay, so let's see. Uh, I'm, I'm just thinking uh, what what is missing in org mode. I mean, uh, over the months uh, since I didn't do any videos, I got some uh, really good comments in my uh, videos and I got uh, people on Twitter that told me, hey, when is the next video coming and what are we missing and are we missing something? And uh, I was really thinking what what's happening with me i mean i'm i'm using org mode now for i guess seven years in non-stop usage and uh, i see that my files have the tendency to grow faster than i can do the things uh, even if i try to be reasonable with my task selection but you know uh, in your job uh, sometimes uh, you can't say no when a customer says i have a problem please help me and even in your family there is uh, suddenly your car breaks you have to do maintenance or something in the house has to be repaired so uh, the things are, are growing so my approach uh, that i don't get crazy was that i limit uh, my daily list to something that is um, how to say uh, the things i really want to do today so every day in the morning the first five minutes of, of my productivity day is uh, I create my daily plan that's an uh, extra org mode file and it has uh, whatever 10 to, to 20 items of the things that uh, when the day is finished those things should be worked on. Maybe they are finished if they are just short things like do the vacuum cleaning or uh, whatever write a, a letter to, to some uh, other person or even longer things that they say I'm, I'm writing a book so write another chapter and so on you you understand the idea I, I just want to have a, a list that, that fits one uh, <coughs> page on the screen so that it doesn't make me nervous and, and doesn't make me feel overwhelmed because the, the, the big uh, thing is if I see my when I when I do this list in the morning you know uh, I mean I'm, I'm uh, using my my real uh, backlog from from org mode my my org mode files and they say okay uh, show me the agenda for today and there is a really really long long list of uh, items that i have to do so i have to, to pick and say okay this is important today this is important today and so on but even the seeing that big list sometimes makes me feel overwhelmed and i say oops how can it be that there are so many things on my list so when I was in, in that state, I was thinking, okay, we, we should need a new org mode extension. We should think about what are we doing and, and we, sh we, we should think, uh, can org mode help us somehow to, to get rid of this overwhelming feeling. So I had an idea, I, I have to show you, because my, my idea is, I mean, when I want to be an entrepreneur, it's not yet decided, but if I go like that, my idea would be, okay, I learn... Uh, Emacs programming and I want to create a new org mode extension that I call org procrastinate. That should, uh, that's really a, a good idea because I have some goals but what this org mode extension should do for me. The first goal you see it is never, never ever feel overwhelmed again. So this is what, what I really, what I'm really looking for. I, I don't want to feel overwhelmed. I just want to uh, how to say um, enjoy and say I, I do my my daily work but but it's not uh, that I want to stress myself so <coughs> if things get stressy the extension should help me so that the idea is I simply mark some tasks where I really feel oh my god taxes today nah I don't want to do taxes today it's 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 too much of a stress and, and I don't want to do it so the extension should say I mark this task and I press P for procrastinate 
and then the extension takes care of that task and say okay I move it to a random date in the future of course I can customize that so that I say okay uh, maybe depending on, on some other uh, indicators like a priority or so I, I move it one week in the future or one month or whatever uh, and with that my daily agenda is, is really small and, and it's not overwhelming and, and not driving me crazy when I see it and maybe we can I have no idea about uh, how complicated org mode uh, extensions to, to program is but uh, one idea could also be that for every procrastinated task that uh, I do that whenever I press P somehow org mode creates a nice excuse why I didn't do this today and I can send this to, to maybe it's, it was my, my boss that said can you give me the report and oh my god I have no energy for that report so I press procrastinate and then a mail goes out to my boss that says sorry but uh, today I was so busy with much more important projects so you have to wait for your pro, uh, for your report uh, a bit longer so this, this is what, what I have in mind. I, I mean, it's, it's only a vision, but it's, it's a, it's a, for me it's a very clear vision that I say I, for, for the uh, matter of, you know, life improvement that we had at the beginning, this, this could really improve my life. So, oh my god, we are already over 10 minutes, so let's uh, go on. I, I really need your feedback on this. Tell me what you think of these ideas. Please use the comments and okay, uh, if you have other ideas that you say, hey Renat, there is still something missing or can you explain something more in detail or whatever, just let me know. I am, I mean, at the moment, I'm really, uh, <coughs> how to say, out of the state of shock from the news from my company and, and I want to improve myself as well. I want to maybe... Uh, do uh, new videos more frequent so whenever I have a job interview I can say look guys I have a big YouTube channel with 2000 and whatever subscribers and they rely on my expertise so that, that's really something that's, that's good sounds good in a um, CV don't you think so so that's all for today my friends I hope you enjoyed the, the news update and don't worry for me, my, my job situation will be fine, I'm quite sure. I'm not afraid of anything, it's, it will be the future and it will be an interesting future, even now when I'm really old. So thanks for listening and sooner or later, I hope sooner this time, I'll be back. Thank you.